Hi everyone, today we will be playing Christ's Tale. Oh, I don't let me play it. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do it. She's so cute. <laughs> Nice. This is a real fight, Chris Bell. Time to use your new skills. Be swift, be precise. First, select attack and then choose your target. Finally, just as the attack connects, press the button one more time to do a double slash. Good, Chris Bell. Be cautious. Watch for your opponent's attack and press the button right when they hit you to block most of the damage. Nicely done. Now give it your all. Finish it off. Well, shit, sorry. <laughs> I'll press an X button so fast. A button. Are you supposed to be? Hello, my name is. Tell me if we survive. You know how to fight? Let us show him. <laughs> Not bad. I'm Christopher, by the way. There. That's two less of them. Been chasing those things since I left St. Clarity. We've got to stop them before they reach town. And exactly how do you plan to do that? Hold your ground. They won't get past us. Look, Volcano. They broke our poor goblins. How adorable. Can we keep them? Gally, we've talked about this. No more pets until... Until I stop murdering them. I know, <laughs> I know. I just want to play. Not my fault they're all so squishy. <laughs> and that's why we can't have nice things. It didn't work. We can't touch them! Not even a scratch? We can't take much more of this. Chris Bell, it is time! Use the crystals! The crystals?
damn frog. Wait, my rose. Chris, oh, I better not keep sorry. waiting. <laughs> sorry, sorry. the L to use the desired direction. Press A to interact with people or objects. Chris Bell, finally. Did you prune the roses yet? I'm sorry, Mother Superior. It's just my rose. He, the frog, it took it. Enough, enough. I've seen that look before. <laughs> Find that rose, then hurry back. There's work to do and no time to waste. Go on. Yes, Mother Superior. Thank you, Mother Superior. And be careful. I worry about you. I miss your grandma, Chris. And how it used to be around here. These just bloomed yesterday. If I take extra care of them today, they'll be even prettier tomorrow. So beautiful. Oh, I'm not the high. Pick every strawberry right now. Maybe I won't have to do it ever again. <laughs> Sorry, they grow back, so you can't do it. Let's <laughs> bother these roses. Rose petals. Press Y to check and repair our objective. I have to get my rose back. Okay. What a lovely day for a walk in the woods. Chris Bell, what's the hurry? Good morning, Marco. Have you seen a little yellow frog? A frog? Well, sure. Maybe wearing a top hat? Carrying a rose? A top hat? Then no. <laughs> Maybe try the mayor's estate. There's always something going on there. I'll try. Thanks, Marco. Sorry to bother you. Are you kidding? That's the most interesting thing I'll hear all day! <laughs> I still have to find that frog. I guess I won't look in here right now. Check out the cool sticker we found! It's a skull! Check out the cool sticker we found! It's a skull! You just get a soft count and get each man staying by stopping in competition. That's what's interesting here. Why would someone do this? <sighs> that Marco is never home. He will inherit this one day. He should help me take care of it. Think about the future! It's not just the farms that'll be renovated. It's the orphanage, the shops, the whole town! Your future fouls the land, poisons the water. Goblin raiding parties are burning our fields. Money, power, your precious industry. That's all you care about now. <laughs> How dare you! Where's your proof? Proof? Look around you. Look at our crops. 
Then sell your lands, Robert. We don't, don't want to do that. You any should... longer. It's what's best for the town. It's best for someone, but not the town. You seem to be doing just fine. Now, see here, I never... Mr. Mayor, we have a visitor. Hello, Crispell. What do you want? Hey, I just came to look for something every so fast, though. Hello, Miss Lana. I was looking for a yellow frog with a top hat. Of course you were. Try the northern fields. That's where all the little pests go, hmm? What are you trying to say? You're trying to say I'm a little pest? No? Okay, I see you. May the lady light your way, Crisbo. Too many in town have strayed from her grace. Oh, thank you. I should go. Oh, you're still here? Run along now. I don't like you. I do not like you. One fair. No interest is at your back. Are you kind of cute? I see you're the quiet type. It's okay. Flowers this way, but still gonna check what's going on in this area. Yeah, yeah. Good morning and all that. <laughs> Good morning. Check out the cool sticker we found. Hey Chris, if you see my mom. Don't tell her where I am, okay? Yeah, I sure did see her. Hi, Polly. How are things? I don't know, Chris. Between the crops, the monsters, the weather... It never ends. Hey, look, like it can be sisters. I just saw your dad with the mayor. They seemed really angry. But they're not, but they look like sisters. Again? I keep telling him to trust the mayor. We need his soldiers to protect us. But it's always, we give the lady our trust. Everyone else has to earn it. I mean, that is true. Sorry, Chris. What's up? I'm looking for a little yellow frog. He was wearing a hat, a top hat. He took my rose. A frog in a top hat? Only you, Chris Bell. I haven't seen it, but I'll keep my eyes open. Thanks, Polly. Maybe I should pray to the lady about it. <laughs> you have been talking to my father. Well, if you're looking for a miracle, I suppose the cathedral is as good a place as any to try. Chest. Flash of feathers was added to the mm -hmm. The cathedral. I've never been inside by myself. Still. Superior finds out I've come here alone.
He looked like her. Or like her distant relative. You are. You have opened the crystals of time, Crispell. <gasps> what are. I mean, who. How do you know my name? So many questions. Matthias the Frog at your service. <laughs> I have been keeping an eye on you for some time now. On me? Why? I suspected you had been chosen, my dear. It appears I was correct. Why me? More questions. The past and the future have revealed themselves to you. Come, see for yourself. I can't. I don't want this. Nothing to fear, child. You have much to learn about your powers. Powers? This is a curse. Why is this even happening? You are upset. Perfectly understandable. But I know someone who can help. He lives in a little hut down by the lake. Leave town? Mother Superior will worry. She would be very worried if she saw you like this. That's true. Is it another talking frog? If only. But sadly, no. Trust me, little one. Let us go immediately. So the left is the past, and the right is the future, and the middle is the present. Oh, thank you. What am I supposed to tell them? They won't believe me anyway. That will not help, Crispell. Please, let us go to my friend. Mm -hmm. Here, see how they look at the father. Ah, uh -huh. so cute. Uh -huh. Oh, she still works here. Oh, it's broken. Oh, I'm looking at it on the old ground. Okay. All right, he's a baby. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, wait. She looks evil as hell. Mm -mm. They're not here no more. But she looks evil as hell. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, that's, that's what he's so cute. Oh, she's so pretty. You are so evil. Oh, he looks hot. I don't know if he's evil or good, but he looks like an evil character. I can't turn around and see the other one side of the right, but okay. She looks hella beautiful. Oh, their house is broken too. I guess they could. Huh? Yeah, I think the house is broken. <laughs> you can save your game while in the overworld. Just open the menu screen and select save option. Remember to save often.
सिंपल सी कहती है Here we are. He lives just over there in that hut. Perhaps you should let me do the talking. <laughs> the soil, it feels warm to the touch. We'll help. Answer the door. We'll help. <laughs> Go away, I'm busy. <laughs> Open the door, you pompous child. We have important business. Matthias? Huh. Idiot frog. You're a child. Manners. You're speaking to a revered time mage. Now, who might you be? Crispell. Um, sir? Crispell has opened both crystals of time. Ridiculous. Impossible. Why not even I have been able to? Yet it has happened. No. No, no, no. There's something else at work here. Can someone please tell me what's going on? <laughs> I am Wilhelm the Wise. You, it seems, are a time mage, as am I. And while my powers have led to my youthful appearance, yours are the gift to see possibility. Possibility? I thought it was the future. Nothing really set in stone. Incorrect. It is a possible future. Perhaps a practical demonstration will help. Take this seed. And plant it over there. Tell me, what do you see in the future? A tree. It's growing from the seed I planted. Exactly. A glow fruit tree to be specific. But take care. It will only grow if you care for it. Otherwise, it will wither and die. So if I do something in the present, I can affect the future. Obviously. Has that not always been the case? <laughs> right? <laughs> now, however, you have the ability to see future possibilities. So choose your actions accordingly. I should use this to check up on Mother Superior and my sisters. They'll be wondering where I've gone. Thank you, Wilhelm. Yes, yes, go to your sisters. You've given me much to ponder, young mage. Hmm. Maybe because he's a time mage, you can't see him. Or he died in the future. Isabel, you had me worried. 
Mother Superior, you're okay. The orphanage is still here. Well, of course. What's got you so excited, child? Did something happen? No, I mean, not yet. I went to get my rose, then Matthias showed me how I could... Matthias? Yes, he... He was just here. I need to find him. <laughs> At least give me the rose you spent all morning looking for. Y yes, Mother Superior. Now, go find your friend. And don't take all day. I you still have to prune these roses. Yes. Matthias? I thought it best not to upset your mother superior with the appearance of a talking frog. Oh. Crispell, I am sorry if I upset you by leaving. No. I mean, yes, but it's the orphanage. I saw its future. Abandoned. Empty. How could that happen? I do not know, but let us look around town. Perhaps your new powers can shed light on this. Everybody's doing okay. I'm sorry. I haven't been talking. I've been so focused on this story. Hope everybody's been doing good. Wow, there's nothing. Mm, she's still here, though. It's old, but there's nothing growing. And then there's like factories. Or maybe the modern day stuff. Okay. Did you find your frog, Crispell? If not, you're welcome to look around here. Yes, quite unfortunate. Unfortunate? The Millers are homeless. Without the apothecary, the town has no medicine. Only in the future, and only if you let it happen. If I let it happen? But... No, you're right. Really? That's strange. The carpenter would have told me something about it. Maybe I'll go talk to him tomorrow. Maybe we should talk to him right now. Why would someone do this? Um, excuse me. I think your shop has rot problems. I don't have time to worry about that right now. If you want to talk rot, talk to the carpenter over to the west. Yeah, yeah, good morning, I guess. Can you help me? There's a problem with the houses. A problem? Great. What did you see, girl? They're rotting away from the inside. In a few years, there won't be anything left. You saw rot on the inside. From the outside? Neat trick. Sounds like someone's been telling you stories about Ash Blight. Happened back when I was a kid. Would have lost most of the town if the old apothecary hadn't brewed up a batch of green leaf tonic. Can you make some? Do I look like an apothecary? Go ask June. She's the one who knows about this stuff. Charming fellow. Right? I mean, but he don't know, he don't know. 
Why would someone do this? This will take forever to sort out. Excuse me, I was wondering if you could help me. You and half the town? No, <laughs> no, I can't. Someone tore the label off of my mushrooms. That sounds bad. Bad? It's terrible. One of these is red button. Good for digestion, great on a salad. One of them is ground death cap. Even the tiniest bit could be deadly. An important distinction, wouldn't you agree? Of course, with no labels, it's impossible to tell them apart. Can't you just throw them out and make some more? Sure, of course. It would take weeks to find the mushrooms, days to prepare them. I don't have time to redo it all. My father used to do all of that. He bottled and labeled them years ago. I'm sorry. I wish I could help. Me too. It'd be nice to have help around here. Since Dad died, though... Mm -hmm. I try to keep everything the way he left it. But there are only so many hours in the day. Sorry, I've got to get back to work. No wonder she's upset. They all look alike. I suppose they do. Let me try something. Ugh, I can't see them in the past at all. Allow me. Press X to prepare the time hop, and then use the L to make the hop in the time. It's cool. A skull on it. I imagine this is the death cap. Press A to prepare the time pop and then press A to make the pop is good. Make magic. Pop I forgot his name already. <laughs> I forgot his name already. Make get this. Pop back in the present. That sticker. I saw it today. Some kids were playing with one. Okay, so after I talk to the kid, I'm going to save, and then we're going to end this for end. Check out the cool sticker we found! It's a skull! You took that from June's! Do you know what you've done? It's only a sticker. That's what they all say. It's only a sticker, but one choice could be from that shop. There, stickers mean a lot. You can't just take things from stores, especially not the apothecary. Some of her ingredients could be dangerous. Right. <laughs> Sorry, Chris. This is as much proof as we are likely to get. Miss June, we found your label. It goes on the bottle with the red lid. Where did you find it? Some kids took it. They just thought it was a cool skull sticker. I don't think they meant any harm. Of course they didn't. <sighs> What's done is done. I'll talk to their parents about this later. Thank you, Chris Bell. I really appreciate all you've done. This might be a good time to ask her about the tonic. Alright, but I'm gonna say we're gonna say. I do believe the apothecary now owes us a favor. Ask her about the tonic, Chris Bell. Okay, so we are going to call this here. 
episode one and we'll come back to this later i hope you enjoy the stream and you enjoy what's going on this is price tales and the artwork is so beautiful the story is interesting also so i cannot wait to continue playing the game and find out where is where this is going or where this is leading and i hope you hope you enjoyed the ride with me uh so i will see you later later